Hey, well, welcome back to Life the Wild Ride. Yeah, I'm walking away from the bus for a minute because let's show you a couple projects or one I did this week. Uh, as you see here, I got the the bus pulled out of here. I think I might have talked about that in the last video. But uh, yeah, I had a bunch of wood that I wanted to put in a place this winter instead of having it underneath a tarp. So Trace and I took a little bit. I had some of this old um, aluminum, corrugated aluminum here. You can see. So we've just built, and I just cut down a tree and got all my posts for it and just built a temporary structure just to get wood under because I'm tired of putting a wood and then putting a tarp and then digging the snow off the tarp to get to the wood to paint the butt. So, you know, we don't burn a lot of wood just in the fireplace, but a lot of stuff I get for free and what we cut down around here. So that's going to make it a lot nicer this winter. Now, another project is I put a new muffler on the Beetle this week. I haven't had the Volkswagen Beetle out for four years. Here's the old one right here. Now, this is supposed to be all closed in, so it comes out of the engine through here and then exhaust here. But one of those is completely rotted off over here. It's gone, and of course, the whole shell around this is gone as well. And I'll turn the camera around and show you the one that uh, I just put on here. Here it is. A new one on the beetle and probably you can see there's actually a shell around those pipes <laughs> so it makes it a little bit more quiet uh, so you guys probably haven't seen the beetle here because it's been put away for three or four years but i got it out this year because we were having vehicle troubles with other vehicles and needing work and i needed something quick to get around with and this thing phew, geez four years of sitting around threw some gas in it fired right up so I registered it, got some insurance on it, and we're driving it. Truck needs truck needs some work. Uh, it's well worth it, of course. It's been a good truck, but it does need um, a ball joint and a brake line and a couple other little things. Oh, front tires. So we'll get that back on the road here, hopefully just in a few weeks. Um, but I've been working on that stuff, and I think I talked about Nathan's truck. His is all back on the road. A whole new exhaust system under it. Well, it's uh, one spot in the frame in the front, so that's all done. So we've been busy. But more importantly, for all of you guys that started following me for the bus, and I apologize, I just have not done a lot of bus videos because I've just been busy. I'm going to be cleaning this up. Oh, yeah, I've made a spot over there before that oil tank. You can see a bunch of pallets laid out neatly there. Uh, we're going to stack a bunch of wood there as we cut up stuff from mom's house and her fireplace and that pile that plastic you see has a bunch of uh, deck boards and we're going to be building a small uh, deck over here uh, to make it easier for mom coming out of the house instead of just walking on these rocks so this will be deck all the way out to here uh, like a little walkway uh, but like i was saying for you people that follow me for the bus well, if you look right there, and if you follow Instagram, you already see, I already put these pictures up. Probably by the time you see this video, probably be a couple weeks ago. Uh, but I got all these doors on, the handles all on. I did that today, which you watching this video is probably a couple weeks ago. Now, these doors are already on, but today I also put all these handles on. And I got the closet doors on right here. So these are all in place. Uh, no handle on it yet, no latch, uh, but they're all on. And I'm getting ready to work on the bathroom door here, which is going to go here. Once I get that one up, I do have the door built for the garage area back there. So I might do that hopefully in the next week or so. And then I just got to finish this here, build the door for here, and build a door for this cabinet, a door for this cabinet. And this one you might have seen in an earlier video. This is where the three drawers that I built will be going. So those will be going there. But I guess uh, I just want to show you that we actually got some work done on the bus. Uh, my plan next week will be propping this archway up here. We're going to put a bunch of these sticks in, push it up nice and tight so I can get the profile I need. And we're going to be making an arch, just a thin arch that's going to support the whole end of the roof here. Once we do that, 
that opens up a bunch more projects. We can put this trim piece in on both sides. Uh, we can build this box around all these wires. We can put this trim in once that box is built. Uh, there'll be a little short one coming down here as well, which means then we can put this trim piece in. So this arch really is the next um, big project we're going to be working on, hopefully next week. So anyway, hopefully uh, you guys appreciate the update. And I oh yeah, I still got to build the door for here too, and uh, trim trim it out of course as well. I definitely appreciate you guys hanging out this long if you're still with me. So I know it's been a long time since I've been posting regularly. Uh, and I do, like I said, I appreciate it. But yeah, the bus is still, it's still going. I just uh, haven't worked on it much lately. All right, well, this is just a quick update. Still got a lot of painting to do. And all of this is going to be repainted. I'm going to come back through with filler, fill all the little nail holes, clean everything all up nice, and uh, repaint everything again. Because there'll be trim here too, supporting the ceiling. So yeah, we just got some, a lot of little stuff. But uh, anyway, hopefully you are all doing well as well. Uh, like I said, I appreciate you guys sticking around and following along. I gotta still do the power too. I gotta get power to the bus. I'm almost there. Just haven't finished it yet. Because right now I just run a cord out. But I got this giant cable here if I have the power hooked up to the to the um, panel back there and everything I could just plug in and have power to all these all these uh, outlets and stuff but hey uh, I guess that's it for now thanks again thanks for swinging by life the wild ride have a great day we'll see you in the next video